Las Vegas gearing up, getting ready to count down to 2023. Preparations unveiled today for the big New Year's Eve bash. Yeah, so of course, as usual, a lot of major roads are going to be closed in and around the Strip, and that's going to impact traffic. Joshua Pagero shares the plans. Road closures will begin on Saturday at around 6, with about 4,000 metal barricades placed at several spots along the Strip to control vehicle and pedestrian traffic. Expect closures at the Spring Mountain ramps all the way to Tropicana ramps. By 8 p.m., no vehicles on the Strip. Clark County Commissioner Jim Gibson says safety is important and the barricades should control crowds. We insert them uh, in the intersections principally because the, the thing we're concerned about is, is vehicular traffic there with all the people in the roadway. And 400,000 visitors are expected to ring in the new year in Las Vegas. The company switches housing the command center for law enforcement. Assistant Sheriff Andrew Walsh says Metro will be out in full force. We take a look at events that happen across the globe, not just here in the United States, and look for all the different ways, uh, especially some of these things that we've seen are very unsophisticated in style. You know, a vehicle into a crowd doesn't take a lot of fourth order planning. And with weather concerns Saturday night, Commissioner Gibson says there are contingency plans. We imagine we'll be able to pull it off, uh, but it is the wind more than anything. The rain is something that can make it miserable out there on Las Vegas Boulevard. After the fireworks show, there will be about 16 sweet sweepers out on the strip cleaning about 12 tons of trash. Josh Bruguero, 8 News Now.